Robert Eggers is coming back with a new horrifying movie. With its 2016 release, The Witch, Robert Eggers cemented his reputation as a filmmaker with the uncanny ability to chill your bones. His horror debut currently loomed large over the medium with its terrifying experience and mental imagery, overpowering sense of pure dread and earthy naturalistic thinking that made his own work feel all too real. Following that, Eggers directed two additional movies, The Northman and The Lighthouse, both of which had eerily creepy but not overtly frightening scenes. We're going to share all the latest information about the movie here. Try to watch the complete video till the end. Hey, before we do this together, subscribe and press the bell icon. The movie Nosferatu will be released in 2024. Eggers is returning to the horror genre with a bang after a few years away. Production is currently underway for his eagerly anticipated 2024 release of Nosferatu, the 1922 vampire classic directed by none other than F.W. Murnau. Eggers is unquestionably back in the horror game. What would be the storyline of the upcoming movie? The famous vampire Count Orlok made his debut in the world in the 1922 horror film Nosferatu, directed by renowned filmmaker Murnau. Its unsettling performances, eerie score, and cinematography made a lasting impression on the history of the film. Numerous horror films that came after, such as Werner Herzog's 1979 remake, were influenced by the film. Eggers' Nosferatu remake is expected to be a faithful recreation of the original while incorporating his own unique style of horror. With his painstaking attention to detail, Eggers will undoubtedly add his own special touches while emulating the spooky mood of Murnau's film. Though the teaser is not available, we expect to receive the most horrifying experience. Although the new remake's trailer hasn't been released yet, we are expecting Eggers to deliver an incredibly immersive and terrifying experience based on his previous films. A masterclass in atmosphere horror, The Witch had a painstaking period setting in a spooky atmosphere, while The Lighthouse was just as unsettling with its cramped setting and two tortured characters. Fans of the genre and those who have appreciated Eggers' work will be thrilled to hear that he's returning to the horror genre. He's made a name for himself as a genre master, thanks to his ability to produce spine-tingling scenes and real terror. To stay updated about your favorite shows, movies, or series, subscribe and press the bell icon. Also, like and share our videos with your friends and family.